Yep guys, welcome to my channel. It's Rome Xblade and in today's video I'll show you something cool that you can do in Prisma 3D like the focus blur or the focusing effect. So here I have a room that I'll just unhide it. So we will make a focus effect in this. So here I have a flower. I will do a focus on the flower. But you can't do this thing just in prisma 3d you will need a editing app for that so let's add a camera and as the flower is not fitting in the frame so i'll just increase the field of view of the camera here okay and now let's make a little animation like here and then i'll make a 10 second animation just my camera will slowly do a close up like this just let's bring it a little back okay so if i play the animation it's slowly like zooming in and let's do some lightings let's change the color of the wall okay so now i'll just render it from 0 to 300 okay so the render is done here if i play this you can see that and this is the first render we will need some renders more so let's add a plane here and rotate it then make it bigger so that it will cover the full background Okay, so it's now covering the full background and just change the color in green because we have to do green screen with this oh, here i have to just do it a little bit more okay so now let's render it again So yeah, here is the second clip which is ready. So now save it, let's save it. And as you can see here, I have a green color here in my object. So it may cause me some problems while coma grief and like doing chroma key in editing app. So I'll just make another clip of blue skin. I'll I will recommend you to do the same because you should also export more like green screens blue screens and you can uh, do multiple renders so if one of them causing problems you can use another so that's the reason that you should do like multiple renders so let's render it so the third render is ready so so let's save it to gallery and let's open our editing app okay so here i am in kind master so let's add the first clip which will be the like original clip okay here we have the original clip and now on the clip we have to add the green screen or blue screen clip as a layer so let's add the clip let's see if green screen is working or not screen set on full screen and now go to chroma key enable it and adjust it a little bit like 
here you can see the green line we don't need it I think this will be enough. Okay, now it's okay. And if I add a blur effect here, let's see. Okay, so this is a blur effect, and I'll just send him to back. Send him back. But here I think the full layer is got invisible because the chroma key is not working properly for the green color. Yeah, you can see here. This is a problem. So that's why I tell you to add multiple renders. So let's use the blue screen so i added the blue screen here so let's go to chroma key and enable it and do some adjustments okay so here now let's add it here and in in animation make it fade okay so now if i play the video you can see the background is now fully blur and the zoom is on the flower but here you can see a little like black or something like for the green skin so you can adjust in in your editing like if you do some adjustments in editing you can fix it so this is the thing and this is how you can do like focus or so at start we can use also a blur for the full screen and just give it a fade out like out animation will be fade something like this okay so if i play it now so yeah so this is the thing and if you like the video you know what to do and we will meet again in next video bye